My name is Chris Luter. We found out late January that we were selected to, uh, to receive rights to perform Harry Potter. When that opportunity came out, Ms. Williams and I discussed it and um, kind of brought a few students on board to run with the application and the, uh, the video they had to make and enter. And um, we thought we'd see what happened and um, they, they chose us. My name is Lucas Scarpace. I'm playing Harry Potter in Harry Potter and the Cursed Child. So Harry Potter and the Cursed Child is a play also written by J.K. Rowling who wrote all the books. It's set 19 years after the last Harry Potter movie. Harry and Ginny are married. They have, their kids are going to Hogwarts for the first time. Ron and Hermione are married. Their kids are going to Hogwarts as well. It follows his son, Albus, and Draco's son, Scorpius, and pretty much their travel through time. You see a lot of the characters you knew from the film, and when they go back in time, they change things, and so the whole Harry Potter universe changes. And um, so it's them trying to go back several times and fix things and get things back to how they should be. Especially for a straight play, not a musical, there's a lot of technical elements that are coming in. Getting just to see all the magic that's involved, all the cool little tricks, all the things that we're gonna get to know and see backstage and behind stage. It's a different approach to it because it's so technically heavy. We are one of 29 schools in the entire country to premiere the show off of Broadway. The pressure is there to, to make this really, really interesting and exciting and something new as well. Being the school that is doing the new shows and being the first ones to do things like that. A lot of the students have seen it in New York and they kind of know what they did. It's exciting to see how we can tell the story in a different way, but still honor what, what is there with the magic and with the, uh, the effects and everything. Getting to play such an iconic character and also in a way that no one's really ever seen before, being that the show is taking place 19 years later and it's all culminating to the eventual performance. The show opens November 7th, or November 7th through 11th. Tickets are available at dracoplayhouse.com.